Can't you allow your heart to greet me? Please, I'll be very happy. I think we, we maybe next meeting we we'll talk about that. And I will prefer your heart to greet me. You can just be looking at me. That does not mean you are not greet me. You start again. You may be seated. Thank you. Hallelujah. I don't know. I don't know. I was coming from uh, my place this morning, and I saw the Joshua block. I said, what is happening here again? There's no lemon water. We are here for service, Sunday service. Does it mean we should not do service again? Huh? 
You know what happened? I had to turn again and look for another entry. What has happened? So, and I was moving, and I saw the people, thousands of people in the canopy hanging around, showed that uh, what happens on Friday, people saw it and they decided to come take a ticket and they joined the flight. And some came so late, I was made to understand that uh, some arrived on Saturday night, Saturday morning from other countries because of what they saw. And, and they, they have been lodging in a different hotel. I don't know. So therefore, I don't know what to do. That should be the response. Is that the right response? When I'm crying and you are saying, ha! Huh? So I know, I know what happened last time when I was crying on the stage here. So you were doing, ah! I will not cry again. Uh, they say me again. So that, that should, this is not the right response. When I'm, I'm, I'm lamenting, and you are saying, hey, I should continue lamenting. Well, that, what is the meaning of that, your response? I know what I'm going to do. Where? I've been thinking about that, praying, what will I do today? You see, you see them, they are just other way around. And I was asking one or two of them, they said they saw it on South Friday, and they bought the ticket, and they, they, so one said he came from, uh, from England, he had to quickly get the ticket, since he doesn't need the visa. And uh, he arrived that night, around 12 midnight, and uh, there were no living water. But they're here now. I said, you are here for what? Can I give, this is tap, go and get water there. So, where? So your, the, your response is not the right response at all. I, I want you to withdraw that response and do the right thing. Do, do the right thing. Ah, uh, again? <laughs> you repeated it again. You repeated the wrong response. Okay, so this is it. And um, this living water, I, since I have not said it by myself, it's an evangelist that was telling you on Friday. The, the content in it the greatest content in it is breakthrough. <laughs> so, I can't wait to see before December. <laughs> your, your debt, your business, your career, your partner, Because these are your excuse when they say, what is wrong with you? Uh, I don't have money. I don't have this. I'll do that. This thing has affected a lot of salvation. A lot of salvation. You don't even mind sickness. Sickness does not mean anything to you. You, can, you see people that say, once they are millionaire, no problem. <laughs> uh, no problem. No problem. You, you are outside there. You are outside there. Every day people go for medical checkup. They don't mind. This sickness does not mean anything. But that poverty. Hmm. That poverty you don't want to hear at all. Huh? People see sickness as a part of lifestyle. Uh, so, but uh, that poverty... So I realized that poverty has done a lot of damage, a lot of damage. You learn that people join the secret court. It's not just secret court because he's sick, but he join secret court because he's poor. He want to be rich. If I'm talking, uh, see, 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 
So this is does it. So we, I, what is there? What is there? I think your business, as far as, as far as that mountain you are going, Okay, Let's, let me just have your, you in just five, three minutes message. Mm. Because uh, the, some of the challenges we have here, let's quickly talk about it, it's only that we don't have much time. So let's quickly look at the second Corinthian. We look at the case of Paul. Second Corinthian chapter twelve. I will take my reading from verse seven. Because of this supercilly great revelation, therefore, in order to keep me from becoming conceited, that is self important. Proud, arrogant. So many of all, you don't know the reason why you are going through what you are going through. You may not know. Listen to Paul. Are you there? Therefore, in order to keep me from becoming conceited, I was given a tongue in my flesh. A messenger of all, a messenger of Satan to torment me. That show what you two are complaining about. The pain you are to complain about is from Peter Hare. It's product of Satan. And Paul is complaining the same here. I was given a tongue in my flesh a messenger of Satan to torment me. Hmm. Listen to this. Next. Verse 8. Till the time I pleaded with the Lord to take it away from me. Just as you are, what, as you are doing now. This is a, just a summary. The Bible says, till the time I pleaded to God, with God. It's a summary. Each time is thousand times. Summary, just three times. Because my, the Bible just summarizes the, 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 the issue. But each time is 1,000 times. Now, three times now is 3,000. This is supposed to. This is supposed to. This is apostle of God. Knowing how to believe that God hears our prayer. Take it again. Knowing how to believe that God hears when you pray. is a much greater blessing because a prayer of faith can be repeated 10,000 times. I repeat again. Knowing how to believe that God hear you when you pray is a much greater blessing than anything. Because a prayer of faith can be repeated 10,000 times. That you have faith does not mean you cannot pray and not hear from God. You can pray and, and not hear from God. 
You can pray and not hear from God. Sometimes, God does as a way. Sometimes, God may not give us what we want instantly. Or listen not to him. It may be to strengthen your desire the more. The Lord knows when you get there and you receive it, back to the wall. What is the essence of receiving it? To strengthen your desire and determination, you may get there. You will just look at you. This God is doing all this for salvation of your soul. He's doing all this for eternal life. But when you get there, God hear me, God hear me. The Lord will look at you. If this man is here, he will go back to the nightclub. What is the essence of healing him? He will now hold on and want you to continue. You will be seeing healing going on. You will be seeing he other being healed. When you see other being healed, that will encourage you to come back again in their process. Your desire and your determination will be what? Strengthening. For who? To build your faith. That will now build your faith. That will enable you to see the, 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 the bad side of going nightclub. Sometimes you, you need time and preparation. A room is not built in a day. By some, they are ready. When they receive, hmm, you will never see them going by. But some, if they have not seen enough darkness, if they give them light, they may probably lose it instantly. So, all you need now is to be where God wants you to. Just like who? Paul Apostle. He was where God wants him to be. Three times he pleaded to the Lord. Hear me, hear me, hear me, hear me. Over to you. To be ready when you receive, when you have that breakthrough, you will not go back amen. to the darkness. Amen. No, over to you. No, there is no amen in this way. Why amen everywhere, every time? Amen, amen. I'm not praying, I'm just telling you that when you are that breakthrough, come instantly. The next thing you go back home and begin to clean those charm. Those sham, those ring, pack them, drop them inside the sea, and say, bye. <laughs> and immediately, you get there, you see, after getting there, you now, I will encourage you, after receiving this living water, after your prayer, come back to your seat and watch again. Others. It's happened, it's happened, it's happened. Ah, this thing I have, see what it's doing to order. This thing I have collected, see what it's doing to order. By the time you see, you know how to pressure it, pressure it. Not just collect it and go back home. Just home. But back to your seat and sit down and watch order. Mm. Mm. Even order that receive, if I were you, I will find time to meet them secretly. In order to build your faith, you meet them again. You see, it's about give a testimony. When you witness it, what happened? You now meet him. Ah, you have vomiting blood. How manage? You have blood in your mouth. Oh, you have blood in your tongue. Tell me. You need to to build your faith. To build your faith. I'm very surprised. So, by the time you sit down and watch and listen to other, you can 
you may likely go back again. Maybe you were not well prepared, but let me go back again. Let me encourage you, you can just, hmm. oh no, I'm going back there. I'm going back there. It's a decision before going there. The decision you, you, you make will determine whether to receive or not. Tell your neighbor. Tell your neighbor, tell your neighbor again. Tell your neighbor again, tell your neighbor again. We are talking of holding of pain, holding, I mean, pain of the past. And you are still holding pain of the past and you are going there. What are you going there to do? You know, let me tell you the being, the heavenly being that are there, you know what they do? So, the people are many here. They will just move, touch this one. Look at this one, it's not ready, they will leave you. Touch this one. This one's not ready. Even some, when they refuse to leave, they kill them. <laughs> they kill them, they just kill them. That's why when you see some people say, oh! You don't know somebody is kicking you, kicking you. Just say one kick, you'll find yourself on the floor. Some, when they kill them, they will knock child. They will, you see that uh, that place is not where, it's not comfortable for you to, to stay. They are there. They will just go. I miss all the people, touch. Some, they'll touch them, touch them. They're the one touching there. They said to me that, uh, look, talk. We take care. We take care. We take care. We take care. What you are seeing now, what you are seeing now, you may not know what it is until each country have it in their country. Each country have heavily sites in that each country, and you see people trooping there all over the world. Each country, just each country. I'm not going there again. I will just talk to you and leave. I'm not going there. I don't. I don't. I'm not going there. Before now, I'll jump there, I'll pray, I'll jump there, say, uh -huh, man, I have not pray. No, I don't need to go there. I'm not the one working there. And I cannot collect penny for that. I don't know. I'm innocent. I just, I actually need that. I mean, I'm not going to, go. I would not go there. When you are going, that's when I will join you to, 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 to take my own. So therefore, there's no need of uh, bring money. Bring money when I don't know who is what you don't. Even the living water you are going to take, very soon that will be stopped. That will be stopped. But it will come to a point that you get there, you, you feel, you, you want to see them, you see them. <laughs> now, we are looking at the... Uh, 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 a, 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 a blessing, I don't know, I just, I just hear that yesterday night when I was praying, that maybe by, by December 1st, everybody will start bringing their, their stuff, like material, like station, you want to send to your people, this, that, this, that, any gift you want to send to your people, you have a child, you have children overseas, you have somebody somewhere. I mean, somebody is in a coma, somebody is in the hospital. There's no way you could get there. It, just, it could be a teacher, it could be an it could be anyone, anything. Just think of what your, your loved one you want to send to get that blessing to them. They collect it, they drop it there, drop it there. So when it is time for you to come and pick it, you come and pick it and take it there. Just you write your name, you, you still step your name, type your name, it, your name will be there. Nobody can go there and take someone's property. If you take someone's property, you'll see what will happen to you. 
So you get there, you see your own, you take it. You say, send it to people. In the hospital, anywhere, all over the world, whatever you want for them. People will drop it there. That will be the Christmas gift. <laughs> Not this kind of uh, a CC greeting you send. You send a lot of great CC greeting. The more you send CC greeting to me, the more the headache. Because uh, you, you don't send it through with all your heart. You just send it for selfish, for classic, for materialism. But send something that will change one's life. Send something that will bring a new life to your, 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 your neighbor. You are a Christian. That you are where God wants you to be does not mean you are out of touch. This is exactly what happened to Paul, Paul Apostle. Tell your neighbor that I'm where God wants me to be does not mean I'm out of touch. You know the meaning of that? Temptation can touch you. Sickness can touch you. Pain can touch you. They can only touch you. In this world, there will be tribulation. Cheer up. And he said, But you are now believed that I'm a Christian. I should not be sick. I should not seek. I should not have trouble. I should not have said bad. This is what is deceiving you. And once you see a sick, you are forgetting what the Bible says. That all those things are for our benefit, spiritual benefit. The sickness is for your best spiritual benefit. To improve your prayer. To improve your relationship with God. Look at what you have done to me, Nigeria, all over the world. As a result of attack given to me, serious attack. I, in the history, since hundreds of years, there's no man of God, no pastor, no bishop that have ever faced the persecution I faced. Hundred years. No man, no man of God all over the world that are facing the persecution, the, the, the level of persecution I face, but all these persecution are for my spiritual benefit. So why your own persecution now turn to Crisis. Tell you, ask your devil, why your own is turning to crisis? <laughs> because this is crisis. Little attack. Your business fail. This one fall. Little attack. Damage. But that should not be. If you are where God wants you to be, he will speak his strength in your attack. Take your pen and write. I say, why your own attack destroy your marriage? Why your own attack destroy your, your family? Why your own attack destroy your business? Why your own attack destroy your health? Because you are not where God wants you to be. Paul opposed to attack did not destroy him. Write it down when you get to him, you ask yourself. Paul opposed to attack did not destroy him, and we never learned that that attack killed him. And that attack never stopped his ministry. The greater the attack, 
the more the grace of God in his life. But what happened to you? You talk witches, wizard, witches, wizard. They attack you. They are the one damage your left, damage your stomach, damage you this, give you this, give you that. Think about that. Because of attack, we have run, skater, skater, hater, skater, witch doctor, occultic, John, some John secret court, John abad, some abandon their faith. And the Bible says in that 2234, it said to us, I pray your faith will not fail. That show he has foresaw something that will attack your faith. If I say, I pray, you, you, you reach home. That shows something will happen to you at home, on the road. If I say, come, let him pray for you. I pray you will reach home. You mean they will attack you on the way. That is the meaning of, I pray you will reach home. So did Jesus say, I pray your faith will not fail. That show something will definitely attack you will attack your faith. But what has happened today? The tongue in his flesh is from the pit of hair. A messenger of Satan, just as yours. It's not say it's from heaven. It says from pit of hair. That means from Satan. It's Satan that attacked me. As you are complaining that Satan, the demon, witchcraft, wishes this, the same way. That you are where God wants you to be does not mean you are out of touch. Tell your neighbor again. Say it again. Again and again? You are to touch. So I want to leave you now. You are going back to your to your mountain. You, you know the reason why I want you to go back there? Because you don't know where you are going. You have gone there, some of you have gone there, but you think it's your bedroom. It's not your bedroom. If you, what this lady was saying today that I saw Jesus, he said, hey, hey, people are free. Yeah, he said, oh, see this woman lighting complexion. Oh, what is he saying? Leave the place. He said the truth. God just want to reveal it. And he can reveal it to anyone. But you, what, what, is, what was going in your heart when the lady was talking? He said, Auntie, I, I, I see it by myself. Uh, what, your, eyes, your eyes is shining. It's only you that can see. It's true. It's true. It's true, my sister. They are there. For the pure heart. Unforgiving spirit. You go there, you will not see anything. You rub your body, you, your body will just get dirty. Unforgiving what? You hold pain of the past. Somebody sack you, you will have been the general manager of the company, but they sack you. You will never forgive the man that sack you, that lie against you. If you continue to hold that offense, you come here, you get there, you just rub your body on the dust. Put it behind you. If I'm the type that hold offense, will you come here today? 
You know what you have done to me in the past. I can see your mouth, the book, ban, the book, ban. <laughs> you know what you have done to me? Re recast. Think about what you have done in the past. If you say you have not done anything to me, what of your brother and your sister at home? How you are banding me, losing me, over my dead body, never come here. And you say you, you will continue to hold off him. For what? Of what value? This is it. The density that has been lost, they cover it here. Yeah. So please, God loves and values you. You are where His Holy Spirit dwells. Tell your neighbor, God lost me and value me. I am where his Holy Spirit dwells. Say it again. Again and again, write it down, write it down. Again and again. Yes, he loves you, he loves and values you. You are where his Holy Spirit dwells. So please, this is why, he, this, is, this is a platform for you to recover your, 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 your career. Yeah. Tell your neighbor, this is a platform for me to recover my career, <laughs> to recover my future, <laughs> to recover my business, my finances, my marriage, my family, my good health. If they now begin to, you know, Asha, their job is to ask you to go. You tell them, I'm not ready. If you are not ready, their duty, they must discharge their duty. Their duty is to just the first person there. Okay, yeah, you see? Just do it, wave your hand and sit down. You have to finish your reconciliation in your heart. Reconcile your account. Unforgiven spirit, pain of the path, bad feeling towards others. If there's anyone you have kept in this prison, for reason, you key your loved one, and you decide to go to the court, and he stolen your property, and you decided to go to court, and the such person was arrested, take it to jail, or whatever way and whatever way. This time when you live here, meet your lawyer for counseling on how to go about it. Find time, go to the prison, pay a visit to such a fellow. I just want to come and visit you and to let you know that all things pass away. I'm working out how to get you out of this place. Let him know and start working it out. And let it go, okay. Let it go, unforgiveness spirit. Let it go, bad feeling. Let go, pain of the past. You need to know where you are going. If you know where you are going, Forgiveness will be your, 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 your role map. Forgiveness will be your what? Love. Make me your channel. Your channel of forgiveness. Where there is sin. Lord, make me your channel. Your channel of pardon. Where there is injury. That is it. If you know you cannot do that, you can, it's difficult to reconcile, don't go there. Don't just go there. You can go home and say, no, you need a lot of restitution. 
Yeah. Your business will not remain the same. <laughs> Everything you have lost, you recover them. The little, the little, the little living water you are going to get, the full cup is too much for you. Just little one. When you get it, drop it in your cream. Drop it in your, your, a, 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 a bottle that you can be spray like a perfume. Drop that and be spray it, turn it to your perfume. Turn it to your perfume and begin to spread your body. Spread it in your body. Spread it. Spread it. When you now begin to spread it in your body and your body is wet, like, look, look here. Uh, you, you, you yourself, you should see it yourself. Don't worry. Don't let anybody see it for you. Look, spray it. Here, you know it can be wet anytime. Just spray it here. Eh? Spread it here. Little here. Little here. And, and you, I, next Sunday, I want to hear a lot of breakthrough in the business. Can you see? Can you see? Can you see? When I talk of breakthrough, see the church. So, thank you very much. So, now, after today, see my mouth? It will long, so long, before we measure anything about this place again. This body, this body needs rest. I will, if I don't measure anything about living water, will you come here for living water? <laughs> That's it. I'll just, I'll just minister and then lay hand. This, whatever you want to take, go and take it. Because we want from next Sunday, Testimony, 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 testimony. So, I want to use this occasion to thank my, 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 my staff, usher, evangelist, um, different department. For the past three days. I don't think any one of them have, a, have a, a, a little sleep. It has been on and on, on and on, on and on, on and on. And uh, today, we thank God. I thank God. I will not say more than that. So, but today, shine your eyes. And like I was saying, if you are not ready to go there, don't go. You can wait till the end. See yourself. You know, you are a human being. Sometimes you want to see so much to recover yourself. If you have not seen so much, it's difficult to recover. Why some? We look differently, think differently, act differently. Some, when they just look, they understand. Where some, they have to look and 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 look before they understand. If you're that type, don't be in hurry. This is sins of the Spirit. This is a grace for you. When they ask you to go there, you can say, no, no, no. But when you are seeing, say, Lord, Lord, I'm seeing this happen. What is happening to people vomiting blood? Oh, no, 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 no. Business is, is just a tip of somebody who, look at everybody sit quiet. But by the time they get there, you start seeing them vomiting blood. And after that, they will tell you their pain is gone. Kidney is gone. Everything is gone. And you are talking of business. It's just take that little level water. Drop it inside your bottle. Spray bottle. Spray it. Drop it. You can drop it in your cream and mix it. Your cream. Let's see what is happening, going to happen. So thank you. So please, 
People sitting down, they, they, instead of carrying one, you just five people will go there. Even ten will go there. Let them continue rolling and let's see what is going to happen. All of them carry all of them there. So because there is no time. Everybody has pain. Some pain of the business, pain of the finances, pain of the marriage. <laughs> they carry plankard. But they, everybody here have their plankard too. So, pain of the marriage, pain of the business, pain of what again? Eh? Eh? Our children getting married. Our daughters. So, different pain, different pain, different pain, because people are not carrying plankard. You are now given that absolute time for those who carry plankard. Look at my mom, madam here. Come on, stand up. I'm happy to see you. I was listening to tell your testimony. I was the one who sent them back that they should congratulate that lady that spoke. Because so much crowd on Friday, she, she found way among the crowd, and the camera could not even have a record of her. They looked for the record, they could not find it, because the crowd was so much. She is one of them that skews herself. And got, she got to the, to, to the mountain, and the robbery, body robbery, and it got here. And he didn't let the medical report, the medical doctor confirm is he. So that is, she still can to testify. I know many of us here. No, now nobody knows you have this. You will never come back. You pretend as if you have never been here before, but she came. Because she is a believer. She understands what it means that, ah, Robin Go is a great sin. I said, saw a healing in the past that encouraged her to come. Let someone also see her own healing and come. Congratulations. So those of you that wanted to hide there, you want to hide there, you want to dodge, you want to put on mask. There are some people that wear masks. Last Friday, I caught two brothers that wear masks. The mask is he just put that mask, and the mask looked like another person entirely. And he now put beer in that mask. Was it? Say, oh, Uncle, we wear bars here. So after the healing, he will remove the mask. Bye. God, you cannot cheat God. God is not a man. You can walk. You can cheat. So please, let us be faithful to our Creator. Thank you very much.